right, welcome back. Later this year, Indianapolis will be celebrating its bicentennial, and there's a brand new logo design that you'll probably see quite often out there. Joining me today are Mandy Walsh, who created that design, and Scarlett Martin from the mayor's office. Uh, let's start with you, Mandy. C congratulations. Thank you. Um, what, how did you get involved in this whole process? Well, um, I've been working at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway for 19 years. Um, as a graphic designer. As a graphic designer, yes. And um, one of our bosses told us about it. Um, and we always, um, you know, want to try something new, right. try something different than race cars. So um, I decided to, you know, give it a try. Our whole department pretty much did. So um, I thought it was a fun project. And um, working at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway, I feel so connected to Indianapolis. And I think it's just a great city. I love it. Yeah, and uh, what went into the design? What was your what was your vision here? Well, I actually had a lot of designs. I <laughs> I submitted a lot because I really had fun with this. Um, I, I really enjoyed it, um, but I felt like a lot of um, a lot of people have embraced the flag, the city flag lately, right. and I I I think it's a great looking flag. So um, I really wanted to kind of bring that in. I love how the roads kind of come to the you know the circle All together yep. and oh. I love that so that's kind of what I went for Scarlett uh, what went into deciding the winning logo yeah so we have a mayoral uh, create Indie advisory committee um, so that group was able to review all of the logos and narrow them down to a select group. Um, they made recommendations of, I think, four to our Bicentennial Commission, um, and the Bicentennial Commission then selected this one. That's pretty cool. And how will this be used? Is this going to go all across the city? Yeah, absolutely, all across the city. So it's already being uh, sold as T-shirts, okay. uh, IndyTurns200.com slash shop. Um, it's out there on the Indy, uh, Indy Y uh, signs that are throughout the city. Um, so you're already kind of seeing it out there, yeah. but it's going to be out there even more. And that's got to be pretty exciting, Mandy, to see your design yeah. all over the place, yeah, right? it's fun. Yeah, it's going to be fun. Mm -hmm. uh, there's also a People's Choice Award, I yeah. guess, going yeah. on. You, you won't be involved in that because that would just be <laughs> cheating. Yeah, she can't double win. Right. <laughs> um, but yes, the, absolutely. So the People's Choice Award is going on right now on Facebook. So if you go to our Indy Turns 200 Facebook page, there's uh, an album of all of the uh, different designs, and you can go in and like them, and okay. a like is your vote. So you can just do it online, which is which yeah, is so nice for, as well. Yeah, so for about one more week, I think we close it out next uh, Wednesday. Can you give us any um, information on some events that are being planned right now? Yeah, so uh, it's still a little hushed, but okay. we are planning some events. So we actually launched the Bicentennial in June of this year. Um, so I think you can anticipate a big public event and launch in June. Yeah, 200 years, man. It's un unbelievable, that's mm -hmm. for sure. Um, congratulations Thank to you, you for winning this. We appreciate you, you coming in as well. And uh, look forward to the big celebration here in the yeah, city. It should definitely. be a lot of fun. Congrats once again.